Place 15 milliliters of the sodium hydroxide solution into a 100 milliliter beaker using a pipette and add 10 milliliters of coconut oil. You can also add dye. Using a Munson burner, heat the mixture to a gentle boil, stirring constantly. Boil for 20 minutes or until all the water has evaporated. Carefully remove the beaker from the heat and let it cool down. Test the pH of the initial soap using the pH paper. Place 15 milliliters of distilled water into a 100 milliliter graduated cylinder and add it to the previous mixture, stirring with a stirring rod. Using a pipette, take 15 milliliters of saturated chloride hydroxide solution placing it into a 100 ml beaker and heat it until it almost boils. Add a sodium chloride solution to the soap mixture. Go for a plastic cup with cheesecloth and pour the liquid into it. Here we are decanting the liquid. Place the solid soap back into the beaker using the cereal rod. Measure the pH of the soap with a new pH paper. Repeat the previous steps since adding the distilled water to the soap mixture two more times. Press the soap between pieces of filter paper to remove as much liquid as possible. Place the final soap into the mold, pressing it down and let it dry. If the pH of the final product is between 6 and 10, it is safe to use. In this case, test its ability to produce suds by washing your hands with it.